Hello. Welcome to our beauty shop. How are you doing? Well, how can I help you today? Mm -hmm. All right. You're looking for some new products. Anything in particular? Makeup and um, some hair, hair products. Okay. Well, I can show you some of our... Um, most popular lines and we do have a lot of samplers that you can try out. All right. Well, one thing um, that's really nice to start with, I don't know if you've ever used these makeup charts before, but it's a really nice way to try out different um, looks and you can record what you've done so if you find something you really like you can recreate it. There's um, a few different styles. Here's one. You can um, actually draw on there if you like and there's a place for face, lips, eyes, and skin. Uh, you can record like what kind of foundation, blusher, you know, all of the different things, products you use. And this one is, um, it's just another style, and again, you can actually apply the products to this. It actually comes in a wipe-off version, and record down here what you've used. And this is another very basic one, um, and it actually gives a very plain haircut, so you can add hairstyles onto this as well. And you can record everything on the side. Um, actually has little spots to put in your foundation or lip colors, whatever you want to use. It. So we actually give these out. We can give you a pad of um, the different kinds if you would like. Mm -hmm. right, well, um, start with some basic face cleansing. We um, sell the most of this. It's, I know it's very basic, but it's actually Humphrey's Certified Organic Rich Hazel. It's a little more expensive, um, but it's really gentle on your skin, and it comes in a plain uh, type of bottle and also a squeeze top bottle, if you like that better. Mm -hmm. And witch hazel is a lot gentler than alcohol, of course, but it gives you a little bit of astringence, which is nice. And one thing, if you have really dry skin, um, I know this is very basic, but a lot of people forget about it, which is Johnson's baby oil, and it smells really nice, and uh, it's nice on your hands, too, if you get dry hands in the winter time. I love the smell. So this is a sampler bottle if you want to try that out afterwards. Yeah. And I also have a couple of lotions. Uh, this is a... I really mainly like this because of the scent. It's citrus and coconut bottle. It's by Essence of Beauty, and it comes in a nice little squeeze bottle. It's kind of a pale lemon color, and again, it just smells really, really pretty. 
also the same scent if you love that citrus um, coconut. It comes in a nice body mist. This is a simple spray. hair but this is just a recent favorite it's called um, sunkissed blonde lemon highlights and this is by organics and you actually don't have to have blonde hair to use it it will um, help with shine and if you have a lot of flyaway hair it helps with that it says highlighting, activating citrus oil mist. A tropical blend of sweet citrus oil to enhance shimmery sunlit highlights with rich coconut oil to smooth and add shine for hair that is silky, silky soft, while exotic. Key lime extract is also um, included and this really smells good. Just a few spritzes is, uh, is all you need. Let's put just a little bit so you can smell that. You could almost use it like cologne, except it's probably not good for your skin. But I really recommend um, this. And it comes in different size bottles. This little bottle is only four ounces. It's not too that you did have dry skin. Um, this is Jason brand, which is all organic and uh, cruelty free. And they have vitamin E in several different strengths. This one is 32,000 IUs, which is very, very Super rich emollient treatment, perfect to target problem areas. With use, its skin smoothing antioxidant power helps minimize the appearance of scars, wrinkles, and stretch marks. Gently massage on face, body, and hands. Reapply as needed. This is really thick, and I recommend you can see it's almost like a glue consistency if you haven't tried vitamin E before um, I'd recommend maybe starting with a little bit uh, thinner mixture because this is super heavy duty and some people have a little bit of an allergy allergic reaction to it so but it's really wonderful for uh, for dry skin. Okay. Now, I um, didn't have too much eye makeup things to show you today, but if you're just looking for some very basics, uh, I do recommend the pencils. They're very versatile. This is Ardell uh, Pure Black, and this is Physician's Formula, which is a brown black. And you can use these on for eyeliners, for eyebrows, um, and for even for making a cat's eye look. These are nice, and they're smudgeable, which is really. And for mascara, this is Maybelline, which is kind of the king of mascaras. They have, gosh, probably 20 varieties, but I like the very basic Super Lash Water Soluble. So, yeah. it's good to just have a couple of basics on hand. 
and I wanted to show you, um, I find that a lot of women like these little kits. They're called Wet and Wild. It's, it's just called um, Color Con. And they're really nice because it comes in a set so you can use all three together and you don't have to search through a whole bunch of eyeshadows. And it's in a nice little case. And they're actually labeled, so like brow, bone, crease, and eyelids. Comes with both a foam brush. And it also has a um, little soft bristle brush, which is really nice. Really cute little kits. And one comes in several different color schemes. And then on the back, it shows you how um, you can apply the three different shades if you want to use that suggestion. And these are kind of inexpensive, so you can get lots of different color color schemes, which is fun. All right, and I did um, bring out one perfume for you to look at, since you do you said you liked citrus. This is um, Love Toast, which is a really cute brand. I love the little <laughs> decorations. And this is called Honey Coconut. And it's a, just a sweet little bottle. And it's really, um, lasts a long time. So it's a nice fit with the other citrus and coconut products. I really like this. It's very sweet. Smelling. And oh, I forgot about this one. Um, along with the eye pencils, I would recommend at least getting one liquid liner. This is Elme and it's a basic black. And this one, actually, rather than a brush, it has a little foam tip so you can get a very uh, distinct line, thick or thin, however you like it, and it's a really, um, just a convenient product to have on hand, put that up there. So, for lipsticks, um, I just have a couple that been using lately and um, it's by the Milani brand and I only brought out two colors but it comes in about seven shades. This particular line is called a lip stain actually and um, it's kind of interesting because it has a little ratchet system and it has a brush here so the lips, uh, lipstick comes out in the brush and you brush it onto your lips and you can blot it or just leave it as is. And the nice thing about it is it will last pretty much all day if you don't put a lot of um, gloss on top of it. So it is kind of glossy. Unless you blot it, then it will be more of a matte. So this is kind of a basic pink shade. This is a little bit more of a bronze um, natural lip shade. And then I have a pretty uh, kind of a coral shade and different reds and more burgundies as well. And just for general lip protection, I really like these. Um, it's called Badger Brand. This one is Sweet Orange. And this is Vanilla Bean. They smell really wonderful too. <laughs> and it just has the basic screw top. 
and this also comes in um, I think about six other scents too so you can I think there's a pineapple and a chocolate a lemon tangerine these are really fun and great for dry weather so do you have some more time I can show you um, some of our nail polishes okay first of all I wanted to show you a nail polish remover this is pretty New York City it's a soy nail polish remover with the lemongrass scent it's much gentler on your nails than the standard acetane type of uh, remover so I just find that it uh, it's, it's gentler, it's just gentler on your hands and on your nails. And a small bottle like this, which is uh, two fluid ounces, does last a pretty long time. So I would suggest that. And we have some of our, um, these are Revlon nail colors, and I just brought you a sampling. These are very long lasting. This one is kind of a lipstick red. It's called, it basically is just called Revlon Red. And this one is called Iced Spice. I really like the Iced Spice because it has a bit of a metallic shimmer to it. And this is more of a flat red. Sally Hansen makes another really nice line. It's called No Chip 10 Day Nail Color. This is also a little bit of a metallic sheen to it. It goes on really smooth. And this comes in about uh, 14 different shades. Mm -hmm. And we also just got this line in, it's Physician's Formula, and they're really sweet little line because they come in a three pack stack like that <laughs> in different colorways. So this one included a kind of a bubblegum pink, a bit of a tomato-y red, and this I would say, what is this called? They call this California Goddess, which doesn't tell you much about the color, but it's kind of a pale tangerine orange, it's like a creamsicle color. And it's fun because you can mix and match if you like doing that, or making a stripe, or you can use um, just one at a time. Sometimes. Um, it's really nice to layer your colors. So, for instance, you might put a darker base coat, and then when that dries, take a soft uh, shimmer like that and put it on top. And then you get the dark color kind of peeping through with a little bit of shimmer. So it makes a really nice effect. These are really fun. I think they're going to come out with more colors. They have one. It's more of burgundies, and uh, they have some pale, paler colors too. This is a nice sampler. And it's always good to have just some clear base coat if you don't have any. Um, this is Sally Hansen. It's called No More Peeling, and it can be used as a base coat or a top coat, uh, or both. If you like to use both. Um, it, this is one of the nicer ones. Some of the clear coats have a little bit of yellow tint to them, uh, but this one gives you a nice clear finish. So that's all um, we have right now. And would you like to just try some samples and uh,
browse around the shop a little bit. Okay. Well, um, I'll get you your uh, pad of your makeup chart so you can take some notes on it. And feel free to ask me any questions. Um, or if you'd like to try any samples, uh, please feel free to do that. Okay. Well, I'll see you soon then. Thank you. Bye-bye.